Greatsword legit feels really good right now and it's even getting another buff so let me show you how I play it. This is probably like the best game I've had with it, the most consistent and I want to see more people try out Big Sword so I hope you enjoy it. There was no camera here because I wasn't feeling too well but yeah. It's a, bit, it's a really bad shovel opener though. But this is what it is. It's... Yeah, if only uh, the metal is better for Poison Ivy. Alright, new gamble guys, put your beans on the line. I feel like I've been pretty consistent today, but uh, the thing is like... What I'm trying to do just isn't matter, right? Maybe I should just... Go for the hero longsword. They fuck it. Whetstone or no whetstone? The torch is pretty good. But I don't think so. No, no, actually, no. Ooh, nice roll. All ranges in survival. Yeah, I mean, I think it's just because ranges make it to survival, right? They have the strongest thing to do right now. Reaper is strongest early. Uh, so I'm gonna lose here because it's a Reaper. And I'm missing all of my attacks. But in the end, it's just a burst of, of ranges that they can't deal with. Oh, I have a shot. I crit. I missed again. I have a shot. Right? Please. Zero damage. Miss. Dude, you can't make this shit up. Miss again. Okay, thank you. I know I have blind inflicted, but it still has 75% 70% chance to hit. It's not like they have 50%, you know? <laughs> and then when I hit the, the buckler triggers, that was too close for comfort. It didn't have to be that way. But I lost that. I mean, that's fine. It's, uh, it is sort of this, you know? Lucky pig. I haven't made one in a while. Lucky pig is worse if we do leaf and ivy. But I haven't really been playing leaf today. I mean, I've played bloodthorn once. I think I make it. I could also get the second garlic here. No. I could play it. They're going heavy on the shields, but I saw one. Yeah, I think shields fell off. I mean, I've, I, I, it depends on what you face, I guess. If everyone is playing this stuff, it's good. But I prefer going for healing instead and just uh, shovel, it's a big weapon. Well, we have our own spike shield on this gun here, so I guess we take it, huh? I can point Lucky big towards a lot of things on my board right now. I think on shield is best, right? Chance to remove stamina seems a lot better. Or is blind better? I don't think it's torch. It's two shovels and play any good. I haven't played it yet today. I think if you get lucky early, sure. But I usually I just go for one and then either torch or spear or pan. Um because it's really good against what people are doing right now. We can run Grubert now, because we don't do the whetstone starts. Do I want to run Gruber? That's a different question. Trumpet is back. <laughs> I'm not looking just a Gruber. It's a Reaper. It's gonna be a bad matchup. Because we don't cleanse the poison. And we're kind of slow, right? We're not bursty. Like for Reapers, you need high RD damage. We don't have that. Also, we're blinded. It's missing a lot. Some honking. What's oh, close? Oh, we actually won. Okay. I want the second banana. I kind of want to do Dark Saber this game. But I'm just going to again see what they get, right? Do I take Spear? No. Box. I, I, this doesn't do anything yet. I cannot take it. Hungry. Okay, we can do this for now. So, mana orb. 
Do we have mana first? Is that ever something that we can do? Hmm. Actually, we should we should do different. Yeah, I don't think mana first is ever the move. Yeah, I think mana torch is not good. I've not seen any builds. I, I sometimes see a build in survival with it, but I always beat it. I just don't think it's good. My hypothesis. Hypothesis. It might just be a platform game. We'll see. Yeah, we'll see. I'm looking gloves. A crit root stuff is viable if you do a uh, insta lamp. I've won with insta lamp. But the issue is just getting there. We need to get pretty lucky shops. Like every time I won is because I hit a magic wand in a single turn. Because if you have to play with broom, that's awful. Can I take more herb? We could play arrow with it. Huh. Instead of. Wait. What is the benefit? I actually don't know if there's even a benefit. I mean, this means we can still go lightsaber if I take this. And dark saber. Which I think is better because everyone is just running stupid rip saw blade, right? I wonder if this is overkill to buy. I'll buy it. Just because it has potential to be good. But yeah, I think you still just always take leaf if you want to go hungry, uh, but for an because I don't see the benefit of arrow, except for the crit bonus damage, I suppose. And the flexibility to pivot out of Bloodthorn into something else, but I don't know why you would do that because Bloodthorn is so strong already. I mean, the only reason to do that is because you're facing too much Rip Saw Blade. This video was a blast, thank you. At least my early game is better. I used to struggle a lot with early game dispatch, like I kept losing rounds, but now I'm very comfortable. Like I'm usually on 4 HP or 3 HP. And all I've been doing is building a shovel and picking healing items, right? Food and herbs. And just playing any secondary weapon. Reapers can be a bit tough, but there's just so much ranger, that's good. But I don't think Leaf, Leaf is good with lightsaber, no. You don't need that much uh, regen. A couple herbs is enough. Because it's for like four seconds or something, right? Also, you don't, what do you want to make dark sabers? I'm pretty sure because dark saber has a better ceiling. Did I lock this in case I had lightsaber? No. Aiken color is good for next round. I have three cloves already. It's already good. Is it's more to force a bolt every game? No. Today I've not been forcing anything. I've just been playing what I get offered. And I've, this is the most consistent I've been. Every game, I've either made it to 9 wins, I've won, or I made it to deep survival. Other days, I like 4 stupid balls for content, but... I mean, today I don't have the energy for that, so I just... I just do this. I just win. <laughs> yeah, I can win if I try, guys. I just need to try. No combining. Combining what? The gems? Hmm, I could. Yeah, I'm buying this. I don't think I'm getting the crystal or the carrot. More luck. Next turn, I need to know what I'm doing, right? Yes, next turn. You stop survival on Reaper. That's probably the smartest play. If you play a Reaper, just go to 10 and get out. I don't think... Maybe it's better to get to 10 not with poison though. Good. But I also think uh, blue gems are really good right now. Because uh, a lot of people are playing potion setups now. I don't know why, but everyone is running potions. Um, okay, I think I take arrow just because it's on this gun. And because we have triple herb already. And because I don't think I'm still doing butt foreign. 
At least I don't want to be, right? Because everyone is playing Ripsaw Blades. Oh, is it Big Sword? I didn't think about this. We have a lot of luck in Acorn Color already. We don't have Empower yet, but we can solve that, right? We have one Glove, a lot of Fanny Packs. We have 4 HP. And there's a Box of Riches here. I think it could un unironically be Great Sword. So what are my options? My options are rolling it, rolling more. The best thing to hit is lightsaber, but it's not likely. I think it's great sword. Like we actually are in a good, a good spot, except for our empower. And now we just go for defensive shit. Yep. Pretty good. We'll just fill our backpack. We want caps for sure. Um, did I play this over garlic? Probably not. Okay, okay. What is our crit chance? We have 4 luck, 1 acorn color. What is that? 40% only. We have a lucky pick pointed towards arrow. I could point it towards the shield as well. So we're just going to be facing this. I think all we have to do is make sure we crit, make sure this goes fast enough, and make sure we have a lot of defensive tools. I might not even have to care about Empower, right? Empower... I think I'm not buying boots. We don't have an Empower setup going anyway. Oh, I didn't crit there. If I crit here, I win. Nice. So right now we kill these bolts fast enough still. Your longsword, torch, bow. We just killed this so fast, right? All we need is one crit. Um, so yeah, I'm, I, I'm not gonna think about the Empower, I'm just gonna think about living. Because last game I spent too much money on the Empower and it never even triggered. Or it doesn't matter, right? Like, I, I die without even getting value from it. So I want this, I want the Potion probably. But I'll need space here. Healing is also good. I could buy here. Is it better than garlic? It is. It is. And I think I do combine. Because the herbs kind of fall off and I don't need them. Oh, yeah, this kind of thing. So, this is what I was playing with double poison goop, like another poison goop here. And I think that's the strongest thing you can do in Reaper. We didn't crit. 16. I need more Acorn Colors. More luck. 114. Okay, we still win though. Unless I don't have stamina here. Ha! <laughs> well. Funny how that works. Never mind. So, blue gems, I'm gonna value. Yep. We could go for books. It's an early enough book that I can consider it, right? Now we just go for mana as a defensive option. Wait, fuck, where does this go? I guess it'll, it'll go like this. 12 gold though. No, because I think the issue with books again is that how do I trigger the mana? Where do I get the mana from? Big sword trigger is pretty slow. The other, I think my board trigger is pretty slow. So I don't even know how I'm gonna get this to work. Unless I have the mana orbs just surrounded by other books. Right, it's this pointed towards mana orb. I don't know. Uh, maybe I can. I just need to figure out how. Like what I use as triggers. No, I can't. There's no way. If I if I maybe run um oh that's good. This gives me luck, spikes, mana. I think Valor might be worth it. It's really expensive though. And I have no space. What is the top priority right now? More speed, more crits. Yes. Hmm. 
Because, like, I would have to spend two turns to fit that weapon right now. Oh, I didn't crit here. I think I need to hit crit into crit in order for a chance to live, right? Oh. Wait, next, uh, next hit, I think I kill him. Because I think it's a crit 90% of the time. Cool. We actually, wait. I'm still at four lives. The big sword pivot was correct. It's, like, legit. People will call this a meme, but... Like, look at this. I'm beating this. And it's not even close. I've not seen other people play it. I've not have a single ranger play a big sword against me. Are they all sleeping on it or what? Oh wow, that is speed. That is more healing. Right, big sword? I would say don't force it. Just go it when you see it and you have a good setup. But don't force it. We can't do double big sword yet. I, I want to do it eventually, but not yet. So do I do this now? Or do I have the health potions trigger the health potion? Because I just need to go for survival again, right? I don't know how fast I stim out. That's the only issue. I think it's actually better to have this trigger this and then this trigger this. Or no, this, this trigger this and this. But I don't know where to position that. Or I just have it like this. Yeah. Yeah, I think the stamina will be okay with one big potion and just have the health potions keep me alive. Still need capital discomfort, still need more, more caps. Um, crit with staff. Are they going for the insta lamp? I think that's their goal because they have the strong stone skin potion there. Oh, I'm not making a potion now. You're right. I do want to be making a potion. I didn't crit on my first hit again. I really need to solve that, man. Critting is so important. I had no stamina already? What? I only did one hit, right? Or what? I only hit once. How did I consume the potion and out of stamina already? I don't understand. I'm gonna be out of stamina again. Wait, huh? I dealt 36. Oh no, I hit twice. Then I guess... On the next hit, I consumed my potion. Yeah, I consumed the potion. I only got two. I need stamina bags. Okay, we need a stamina bag to solve this. But we also have banana now. And I guess we... We... We do the dispositioning then. I do like the gloves. I don't know if I can put them yet. So I do this, 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 make a couple of discomfort. Oh, more luck is massive. I want to make this potion as well, but I don't care too much about it. I don't want to shift anything here. I feel like it should be fine now. Okay. You have a book to stall. 104. Nice, nice. One more Econ Caller and I'm happy. It's 100% done, right? Another crit. One more to go. Oh, yeah, we had the stamina. Perfect. Okay, survival. I'm still so compact. And there's a lot of things that make me a lot stronger. So I think I take it to survival. There's one of those things. Hallelujah. Now it's up to space. I'm not gonna roll with the box in, I think. Big. This is also big. So we don't care about the Empower, right? I think we've concluded that. Empower is not my top priority. Blue Jam necessary? Oh, a lot of people are playing shields. I think Blue Jam might save one of my games. I'm rolling still. That's pretty good. Hmm. So I'm going for more speed, I will use this. Carry one down. I need it as an arrow trigger, otherwise uh, it doesn't give me luck. Is 
This looks good. Bloodthorn. Okay. With a bunch of pineapples. Ah, oh, fuck. Bird is annoying. Because I... Yeah, yeah. I don't gain luck fast enough. What is my crit chance at the start? It's 75. Okay, we still need to value acorn colors and luck. 68 because of the cap. Oh, uh, still at 5 luck now. No crit. It's a big deal because now we need to hit 2 more. Okay, one more. Okay, now it's 100%. Nice. Double big third. It's kind of possible, but I think I'm just gonna go all in on this one because this needs so much space. It's so much money. Maybe in the end I can do it, but right now I'll just stick with the single. Also, I'm not doing the empower stuff. I think if you go with the empower, you can do double, right? But I don't think we get the threshold fast enough. I don't want to throw. A uh, heroic potion triggering another heroic potion doesn't do anything for me, right? More gloves, more cap. Oh, perfect. I think we get the cap first, right? Okay. Ivy. Okay. Double cap discomfort, so we're not gonna deal a lot on our first hits. It goes every 2.33 seconds. Actually, our second hit all as well. It's 5 seconds, yeah. Their first two hits, they were crits, but they were tiny. But now we're gonna start dealing damage. Once both stamina potions consumed. Blue gem? Let's see. Where's Epson? Blue gem not valuable? win anyway that matchup but maybe some other matchups not right without hitting it like that matchup sure i win already but let's say there was a bloodthorn player with that potion setup and i would die in one hit it could be clutch there's no downside to having this more healing potions it's not a bad defensive resource though i don't have space for it now hmm mana orb okay let's see if we can trigger this book also, Shield of Valor might be uh, on the table now, because I can spend some turns optimizing the board. Uh, I'd like it here, maybe. I can move the shield up. I can move it down. I want the book as a trigger, though. It's not a funny now, but that's fine. And then this towards the mana orb, I think. Because I have enough luck, right? I think I actually want this towards the mana orb. Huh. But you can do whatever you want. Uh, I'm, I'm doing this. Nice. We actually got the empower in the end. Where in the end it might be valuable because I have no stamina potions left, right? Um but it was consistently critting. Good. We just beat the blood foreign. We just beat a blood foreign. I won the survival of big big sword, you're right. It's four lives left. This is actually an insane board build. They're actually doing so well with it. Did my book trigger? I actually did not pay attention. I think a second book might be better than just this massive shield. There's basically a lamp comp at home. Yeah, who needs a lamp, right? When you can deal 100 plus damage a hit. I killed him on 9 mana? Okay. But I can fit another book here. I can roll more in case I had a... Uh... I don't know, better gem. Hmm. It's still three more runs to survive. It's still have some time. It's still do better. 
So it's not a blood foreign. This one looks a lot better than the last one I just faced, though. They have a lamp as well and armor. Fuck, they're gonna lamp. Customer coin. Gap what is going through. Gaps of Discomfort are also good against Bloodthorn because I can nullify their spike and other stuff. Okay, they're lamped. But to be fair, lamping isn't even that good for them because they don't crit anymore. And like the damage that Bloodthorn has now, they can have normally, right? So, uh, yeah. It's on a good spot. 108. One more hit. Dude, we're actually just slaying people. Big sword, baby. Still has four lives. You don't really need more stamina. Not be the best weapon. Very satisfying to use. The thing is, it's just hard to make work, right? But I think I think the reason why is people don't really know how to make it work. You kind of know that it needs speed and stamina and power. But I think we took the right decision with just not overdoing it, going like for defensive potions with the health and the caps and stuff. I don't know. And value in crit. You need to insta crit. If you don't insta crit, you can't win. Oh, you can, but it's unlikely. We could use another potion bell here. Ah, man, okay, sure. We're actually using potion bells. How does it feel? Are you guys proud of me? Potion bells. What did it do again? I'm gonna gain random buffs, and once I used all potions, I cleanse for debuffs. Crits. That's gonna make me win the game. Uh, is this more valuable than this? Probably not. The life still has been good. Another book? Yes, sir. I can use it as the last trigger, right? I don't even know if they trigger. <laughs> Let's see. Maybe learning. I need another mana orb, I think. It's another blood for it. I'm just facing blood for in survival, but I'm beating them. They're playing a trumpet. Oh, maybe I needed the other stamina potion. I didn't need it so far, but if I get the empower threshold mat, I might not need it. Let's see, we have a blind inflicted as well. We did a hit a crit, but yeah, they have double cap. My crits are not that big right now. They have a bird, but I'm, I'm perma critting. Our book will trigger. We use both. Fuck, I'm gonna honk. Yep, I'm honking. Book triggers. I honked again. I consume my potions. I have the empower as well, so it's gonna hit. Nice. Nice. I wish I could see, I mean, I can do the math of how much healing I did, right? How much healing did the gems do? I did f about 500 damage. Uh, 20% and 15%, 35%. Hmm, it's not bad. Um, okay. This is good. This is also insane. Hide. So we're playing triple book, double mana orb, arrow, double acorn color, triple luck and lucky pig. So perma critting big sword that gets the bonus crit damage. They have a lot of speed on it. Double glove, yellow gem, blue gem. If they get armor, they die. A lot of healing. Capo is going for normal cap. A um, little bit of empower, which eventually we trigger, but that wasn't my main focus this game. And a great potion setup. I did. I think this is a textbook big sword game. I beat all of the good bolts, right? Like, actually, I, I just haven't lost. I mean, I lost like one run. I'm at four HP in survival. Uh, but yeah, this is textbook how you pivot into it, and how you build it in the current meta. That is like the high damage rangers. If you're facing a lot of Reaper, like if it was different, we had to play this different, right? We had to go for the Empower because we have to go long. We might go double big sword or we might just go for more sustain. Let's see it. Not a Bloodthorn. They have a Amethyst in it. 
and a topaz. Triple bird. I hope I crit. Fuck. But they have no caps. No survivability. Triple Vamclov. Limp as well. Okay, this is a bit weird. I Because I, I don't gain luck fast enough, right? Fuck, so I don't crit anymore. Oh, I do. My book triggered. Yeah, I didn't crit there. Shit. The birds are owning me. Book triggered, but I have zero luck. Yeah, I just lost two birds, that's fine. That's the perfect counter. But the books were good, I saw it long enough. We did what we can, right? So just three wins it is, but three wins? Big sword, I'll take it. Yeah, that was a fun game.